take a rest. The rest of you guys will set up over here. Have a nice cold drink? No, oh, thanks. Well, just relax, okay? Hey, David. Hey, hey good hey, to see you. Hi, hi, hi there. Hey, fellas. Hey, how are you? Shoot it to me oh, this way now. Throw me that punch. Hey. Okay, get her up. Right, now, let's try the other way. Put the light in here, and I want to... Hello. Hey. Let's say, Tiger. Good to see you, Dragon. Come on, sit down. You planning on going back to Singapore? I have my Kung Fu classes to teach. I'm leaving tomorrow. Tiger, I've had some strange telephone calls. Telephone calls? Well, you're a movie star. Yeah, but these are not fans. Bruce. You feeling all right? I'm all right. But if something should happen to me, you'll be my successor. And remember, you must always uphold, as I have, the honor of the martial arts. Wear that garment and wear it well. Of course. Now, when in Singapore, practice that back kick. It's a little weak. Yeah, I'll work it out. It'll be perfect. <laughs> <laughs> And so, farewell. The mourners. Many who kept the long vigil through the night now file in to pay their final tribute. Family, friends and admirers, some from distant lands, Rome, Tokyo, London, all shocked by this sudden tragedy. Bruce Lee's love for the martial arts was perhaps only surpassed by his love of friends. As the dragon, it was said he was feared by many, but loved by all. Teacher, do you think that could have been foul play? I mean, his death was so sudden. If they said that he has been ill, but he wasn't, so maybe there was something. You may be right. I'll have to find out if there was some foul play, and if there was, I'll avenge! I'll avenge! I just can't believe he is no longer with us. It's incredible to think that just a short time ago at the studio...
I said goodbye to him and left, and, and now all I have is this, his, his garment. He said to wear it well. He, he told me to honor the martial arts. By God, I will. Why did this happen? Please, I don't understand. Teacher. Sir. You have to realize this. I worshipped him. David. David, you mustn't be upset. I've just got to know how Bruce died. Could be that was foul play. I'm sorry. I must go back to Hong Kong. David. You will take care. This I will guard with my life. David, if you should need me, I'll be here waiting. Always. Kia, you're all I have now. This is CTV Hong Kong. And here we are at Beacon Hill. And outside the home of movie star Susie Young, where it's reported Bruce Lee mysteriously died a few days ago. His sudden death has indeed thrown this entire community into a state of confusion. And it is still one of speculation and rumor. I've just been informed of yet another rumor. Susie Young has attempted to commit suicide. We will try to get some further information on this as soon as possible. Hey, look! It's Bill Blow! And here comes the head of the Summit Studio, Philip Lowe. Police say he died from natural causes. Nothing suspicious there. Nothing? Nothing at all? That's what they're saying. But the fact that he died at Susie Young's place does concern me a bit. I'm having some doubts. What doubts? I want to know. I'm here to find out. Don't know yet. But they do say that some drugs were found at the scene. The stinking liars. I mean, now that he's dead. Don't get me wrong. I'm not trying to imply Bruce was involved in drugs. You should know that. But they will. No, I don't think so. We must stop that kind of talk. Well, he was a famous person. And that's why they're trying to slander his name? We know by the report that his death was from sudden illness. I know that. But I want something more definite. Sudden illness. What illness? Thrombosis? Heart attack? While making love? Susie Young can give the answer to the last one. Is she at the hospital? Yes. I see. And why did she try to commit suicide? That's strange. Drugs at her place. She's got to know more than we know, that's for sure. Why don't we talk to her? It's the logical thing to do. We've got to start somewhere. Well, now. With a mind like that, you really should have become a reporter. You're right. But first, I'll try being a detective. <laughs> I think that you should relax a little while I see Miss Young. I'll try, but I doubt that I will. You sent for me? I've got word from the big boss in Amsterdam. We've got to get a tape still believed to be in Susie Young's possession. Susie Young? Yes. It seems she taped a conversation in which we tried to blackmail Bruce Lee into carrying dope for us. Then why would she want that on tape? All I know is the bitch taped it. 
Now she's using it as kind of a threat against us, as if we're not having enough problems with her anyway. Now, with Bruce dying, there will be an investigation. Baron is afraid if the police get hold of it, we'll blow the whole setup. So you be sure and have that tape. Don't create any problems. You follow? Get it. But be very careful. You understand me? It's important. You better move fast. I want that tape. I'll have no problems here. Hmm. We'll get it. Hi, David. Oh, hi. What's new? What did you find out? She's still in the hospital. But she's all right, though. But there's something happening that's very strange. You can be sure we're onto something. What do you mean, strange? Well, the police are guarding a hospital. No one's let in or out. George, this attempted suicide and Bruce's death, do you make a connection? I believe that there is something. Like what? I don't know yet. I heard Susie Young had lots of boyfriends. <laughs> As a movie star, she must have had many friends. In that case, we'll just call on a few of them. Being a reporter, it should be easier for you. George, I need your help. I trust you. <laughs> I'll do whatever I can to help you. You know that much. But I tell you, I'm not a detective, believe me. Some strange calls. Now I remember. David! What do you mean, strange calls? Hey, David! Where are you going? I'm going to where Bruce is supposed to have died. Hey, you be careful. Susie Young has some nasty friends, and some of them could mean a lot of trouble for us. Oh, that's even more interesting. Hey! Hmm. Why are you? Would you give us some information? That's so? Huh? Are you a reporter? Mm. <laughs> That's great. I, I can be in the papers too then. And who knows? With a bit of luck, maybe in the movies too. <laughs> hey, well now, what would you like to know? On the night that Bruce Lee died here, was there anything else unusual? Huh? Unusual? Uh, sure. A few hours after the ambulance left here, about ten men came in here. Went to Miss Young's place. What sort of men? You knew them? Well, I didn't know them. What's what? Something strange. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> Name's Wang. <laughs> you will mention that <laughs> in your paper. Yes, I will. Well, what was strange? I'll tell you. There was no one at home then. Don't forget, my name's Wang. Don't forget, get the name right. Listen, David, forget the whole thing. You won't find anything in there. There is something in there. Maybe that guy was simply some prowler. Nothing to do with Bruce. That was no common thief. And that says something. I've got to see Susie. I've got a few questions to ask her. Sorry? No, you can't go in there. Now, come on, I've got my own. Come on. Thank you. Come on. Nobody's allowed in there. Nobody. 
Look, I'm from the Daily News. Uh, sorry about that. Five minutes. I've got orders. Come on. Nobody gets in there. Sorry. Get back. Get back. Come on. 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 Come the whole thing was just a publicity gimmick for my next film. <laughs> and you were Bruce Lee, and alive! Mm-mm. Shh, don't let them hear you. I came to see Miss Young. You mustn't refuse me. You're kidding me. I wouldn't think of it. Sure. Good. Let me in then. And don't let the others know our secret, will you? Right. I won't tell them. Make sure none of them get in. Rely on me. I want those tapes. Then we'll let you alone. What tapes? You must be crazy. I don't have any tapes here. Don't lie to me. Now listen, you. I mean to get them. They're not at your house. Now tell me, where are they? Where are they? You just leave me. And go and tell your chief, the Baron, that I'm no longer a part of his operations. You better go and get out of here. You bitch, you. You're just <coughs> asking for let it. Let me you... go. <coughs> you won't give up, will you? Uh, you, you again! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it, please! Hey, hey, look where you're going, will you? Hey, hey, look where you're going! Hey, 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 hey. Hold it! Hold it! Don't chase him! Why not? That's Lung Fei. Why is he here? Listen, he was the one that broke into yeah. Susie Young's house. He was in with her now. He's tied up with Bruce's death somehow. Think so? David, Rung Fei's quite a big shot. Better not get mixed up with him. I don't care. I've got to find out the truth. Where can I find the guy? Usually at the Rose Bar.
Sit down. Thanks. Are you a policeman? At least you don't think that I'm Bruce. Hmm. Happens I knew Bruce. You did? I must say, you do look alike. Really. But that's not the reason you are in here. You know I'm after Lung Fei. Hmm. Well, are you a cop? You didn't answer that one yet. No. Look at me. Then why do you want him? When I find him, I'll answer that. Okay? <laughs> you seem very determined to find him. Do you know where he is? <laughs> He's just a customer here. That's all I know. That's all I care. Well, uh, in that case, I'll uh, find out for myself. Thanks for helping me out. Oh. See ya. Hey. Hey. Please come back here. I couldn't get anything out of him. Hmm. We better find out why he's after Lung Fei. We better. Lung Fei? He's at the yard. <laughs> you know soon enough, but first, let's you and I have a little fun. His name was George? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, 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 
Now, come on, let's have the truth. Tell me. I've told you, he isn't a cop. <laughs> Tough guy, huh? Well, if he isn't a cop, why is he following me? I won't tell you that. You find out for yourself. <clears throat> Talk. Why is this guy after me? Bruce Lee was his friend. He's dead. He wants to know why. We think you're lying to us. You're a stupid man. Better come clean. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> I'm asking you, who is this guy? I'll tell you one thing, when you find out, you'll regret it. Listen, you tell him this. Keep away. I'm warning him. Or else I'll kill him! Okay? Uh, I'm okay. Long Fei. Yeah, it was them. That lousy creep. Uh, I warned you. They'd be trouble. Huh? Was I ever right? Why did they want you? I'm to tell you. Don't mind your own business. Uh, this is my business. David, you must go back to Singapore. Are you scared? Not of Long Fei, but I am scared of his boss. Who is his boss? He's a hard man. His name's a baron. Number one in the rackets and vicious as they come. I don't care about that. I'm gonna get Long Fei. And that's for sure. Now, look. So far, they just beat me up. But they'll kill me if you mix with the Baron. I'm not afraid of them. I'll destroy them. <laughs> just like your friend. He never give up. There was a dragon. And here is a tiger? And we know the tigers don't travel alone. We're not afraid of the jungle. That's no. what I wanted to hear. Now then, first, I'll start with Lung Fei. One for all. And all for one. <laughs> <laughs> Bring us Susie Young. After all, she is your friend. She trusts you. Hmm? But I can't do that. I told you. Don't ask me. She's my best friend. You have no choice. Easy. I beg you. It's your fault. You got me on. Shut up. Look, why don't you just cooperate? I won't. I won't do any more dirty work. 
Oh, dirty work. <laughs> Listen, you worked in a bar, slept with the customers. What's more, that bar has a real low class of customers. And now, because you're a bit player, you've got morals. You're nothing but a little tramp. Look at you now. Bang. You could have what you wanted. Jewelry, cars, houses. If you weren't such a fool. Stop it! Don't torture me like this, please. Don't torture me like this. Here, take it. You lousy bastards. You're going to answer for this. So, it's you again, is it? You go get that girl out of here. James is coming. Lung Fei, tell Sam he must get that guy out to the plant. He mustn't see James arrive. He's got a delivery. Sam, James is on his way over here with the stuff. Throw this guy over to the yard. We gotta move fast. <laughs> Hold it. You want to see Long Fei? Well, you just follow me. Hi. 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 Oh, I, I got the stuff. <laughs> You've got to answer to me. Where is he? I don't know. Talk. I'll talk. Let me go. Now then, you tell me where he is, huh? I really don't know. I'll try to find him for you. Oh. <laughs> Go on! Go and get him! Eh? Oh. <laughs> Go on! Ha 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 
Yeah, pretty rough going over, but he should be all right soon. Uh, thank you. Feed me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad I sent for her. She'll keep you in line. <laughs> You're lucky. <laughs> Tiger, from now on, she's gonna be boss. She gives the orders. You better listen. <laughs> I do give the orders. But he's a very stubborn boy, isn't he? Aren't you? Well, I'll be more stubborn. But first, we've got to get you well. 
You're patient. Oh, by the way, the head of the crime world's in town. They call him the Baron. You really better get well. What will you do now? I don't know. David, ever since you left, I have been worried about you. I was scared that you get hurt or something. I was quite right, wasn't I? It was nothing. Anyway, I'm making some progress here, and I have to follow through. All right, then. Now tell the police. David, I don't want you hurt. Bruce is dead and buried. Why should you die, too? Take my advice, and let's go back home. Kia, just this once, trust me, I have to find out how Bruce Lee died. If I can mean as much to you as Bruce Lee did, I'll be very happy. No, not yet. Oh. I ordered you to get them. Uh, you see, uh, sir, Miss Young is playing smart, pretending to be ill in hospital. No one's allowed in to see her. And the young man who's giving us all this trouble? Well? We've taken care of him. You should see how we left him. <laughs> I'm not impressed. Baron, right now we're having a rough time of it. The cops are on to us. They're everywhere. Another killing now. And they'll be all over us. Hmm. If that damn tape is found, then we'll have real trouble. Now, this is an order. I don't care how it's done. But I want that Miss Young brought here. And as for the young man, he's just getting too close to us. If necessary, you must kill him. Right. Right. David! David! Susie Young's missing. What? She's missing? What? I think she's been kidnapped. I believe she would never have left, except by force. It's them. Has to be. It's that lousy Lung Fei. Want to buy a paper, sir? Uh, big news, sir. Uh, really big news, sir. Don't get lost. Hey, sir, did you see the headlines? Movie star Susie Young's been kidnapped. Huh? Lee was my master. So what of it? Help me!
Lung Fei, tell me if you kidnapped Miss Young. <laughs> Better talk, or you'll make the papers. Small-time crook Lung Fei found strangled. <clears throat> I'll talk. I'll talk. Yes, we did. We kidnapped her. Where is she? <clears throat> Quick, talk. Where is she? <clears throat> I'll kill you, you son of a bitch. <clears throat> <clears throat> Talk! Where is she? The scrap yard. You people killed Bruce Lee? I don't know, but I didn't. If you've lied to me, I'll come back and kill you. Where is the tape? I don't know. Once more, where'd you hide it? I told you. I don't have it! Stupid. You better hand over that tape. If not, you're going to suffer. And believe you, me, I'll show you I mean it. I swear. <laughs> Hey, hey, what do you want? What do you want? <laughs> That's the phone guy. Hi. Huh? Well, that's quick. I only now just reported it. <laughs> We're fast. Uh, prompt service. Uh, that's our motto. <laughs> mm. Come in. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> What's funny? Um. I want that tape! I don't have it! <laughs> you! Come on! Hurry! Uh. Hey! Where are you going? Checking the line. Hey! Hey, you! I told him not to come in here. Hey, who is he? Uh, telephone's out. <laughs> then fix it. Be quick about it. Tiger. Ah, oh, the tiger. Huh, that's what I said. Now, uh, tell him to set her free. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, let her go. Uh. Uh. Susie, follow me. All right. Sorry, I want you to go with me. Now move.
So you are the tiger. Did you say that this is the Baron? Hmm. You're right. And I'm sorry to say that this time we'll kill you. It's you who I've been after all along. Hmm. That's so. You mustn't, Baron. Please let him go. He's done nothing. Please. I beg you, please. Susie, you've disappointed me. Yeah. You've had it hidden inside that locket. Don't worry about me. Run, David. Run. David, please. David, please. Go. Please. Go on. Don't hurry, David. Hurry, please. David. You liar. You'll regret everything. <laughs> Strange. She should say, give it to the police. Hmm. What's on the tape might lead us to know something about Bruce. Susie, don't you think you've had enough? Do what we say. Make that call, damn it. I won't. You will. <coughs> Susie, since I consider you part of my operation, in that I have been supplying your needs and those of your friends, I want you to do something. Yes, Baron. We... We need your friend, Bruce Lee. Bruce? Why? What for? He's a world traveler. And therefore a perfect courier for us through customs. Oh, no, Baron. Oh, no, I can't do that. That's impossible. Look, just don't involve him. I'll do anything you, you want. But please, just not him. Listen to me. You listen to me. As a Kung Fu master, he's above suspicion. We can involve him in a small way at first, you understand? We can get others to follow. Then we can infiltrate the whole Kung Fu world eventually. Oh my God, the numbers of schools that are opening up thousands of pupils. The market potential will be in the millions. He wouldn't do such a thing. And I won't ask him. I won't. Now you listen. We are well aware of your relationship with him. We know that he would do anything for you. So Susie... Just do as I say. We need Bruce Lee. And when I say we need him, you had better get him. Otherwise, you are in serious trouble. Bruce is my friend. Don't you understand? He's more than a friend. I love him. I, I really love him. She loved him. I know. And they tried to blackmail the girl. Hmm. The police should be notified at once about it. Yes? You want who? Oh, just hang on. David, it's for you. Sounds like Susie Young. Oh? Yes. It's me. What? Well, how did you get away? Never mind that. Have you given the tape to the police yet? Not yet. Are you all right? Look, you've come to the sports stadium. When you get here, I, I have this important information for you. Susie, you there? 
Well? She hung up. Wants me to meet her at the stadium. Stadium? Something funny here. How could she have gotten away from them? He's right. You mustn't go there. No. Even if it's a trap, I must go. I've got to see her. She must need help. I'm going. There. Hold on. Wait a minute. Don't worry. No point arguing. George, get the tapes down to the police. You'll know where to find me. David, wait, wait! Seen Miss Young? Damn you! Son of a bitch! You tired of living? Stop it! Stop it! Don't!
How is she? Well, she's had a tremendous shock. She still isn't normal. So be patient. Kia. Kia. <laughs> oh, God. God. Yeah, that's right. Oh, James. Oh, I see. Oh, thank you. I'll get her. I'll get her. I'll kill him. I shall kill him. Hey, boss. Was that James that was calling you then? Hmm. Yes, it was. He told me that the police have got our tapes. Huh? They have? Now what? It is time that we moved out. Ching Kwong? Yes? You better move the stuff out of the yard right away. Lucy, you must go and get that girl in the hospital. And hide her with Susie Young. Hmm. And I'll take care of that. Dear Lord, take the soul of thy servant, George Wang, whose body has returned to the dust whence he came. May he now rest in the haven of your blessed mercy until the day of judgment and the resurrection of the dead. Your blessing too, my Lord, on those gathered here to say farewell to their dear friend. Come on, hurry! Come on, come on. Hurry up there. Where's your boss? Hmm. 
Ching Kwong. You better make out your will. Now, well, your days are over. Ching Kwong, your days are over. Damn you. You're going to regret this. Will I? Yes. Your little girlfriend will die before I do. What the hell do you mean? You'll find out soon enough. Uh, uh, oh. Uh, Did she say where she was going? Oh, she left this for you. girls to die with you here. Damn you, you murdering bastard. I never claimed to be a gentleman.
useless idiot!
Remember, you must always uphold, as I have, the honor of the martial arts. If something should happen to me, you'll be my successor. Thank <laughs> you.